The River Project has been one that, that we've, we've been planning for a good while now. It's a sales tax project and also there's been a lot of grant dollars that came in with it. Uh, so this is our first phase and uh, we're starting, this project was scheduled to start here in October and this portion from the Oaks Street to Irving is the first section that we'll be working on. So in order to stabilize the banks and, and start the improvements that we have to do, we had to lower uh, this section of the river and drain it uh, so that it can dry out a little bit, which will allow us to do the bank stabilization. This particular part has a lot of bank stabilization that's already been done. As you come down here, you can see the, the riprap that's already in place, but there are some sections that, that need to be stabilized. We'll be doing that, uh, as well as some other work along the banks. You know, one of the elements as we drain the river is to, to look at you know, cleaning some things up. We always try to do uh, cleanups along the river, but a lot of times that's our parks crews, uh, our inmates, who help us out in many situations along the banks or in boats just trying to pick up stuff. So this gives us an opportunity to also clean out any trash that's in the bottom of the river. We did a lot of dredging uh, in the very beginning. Uh, a lot of people saw that going on uh, last year. Um, this particular portion doesn't have any dredging associated with it, but we will do some cleanup of, of trash and things that we find uh, that just need to be tidied up. The next section will be the upstream portion back up towards Santa Fe Park, or the golf course. And uh, we did this lower section first. Uh, of course, we, we released some water here to let it um, downstream and, and coordinated that uh, so that we wouldn't lose the water. But when uh, we start on the phase upstream of this, uh, we'll let the water out of the upper stream portion to fill uh, this downtown section back up so that we can save as much of that water as possible. This project has is, is got a lot of elements to it, which is, makes it kind of exciting. The bank, stabiliz bank stabilization, of course, is, is very important. We've had uh, trees that are falling off in the river as those banks erode, and so we've got to stop that erosion. So that is one of the major components that we're focusing on. But in addition to that, we're really going to focus on a lot of the aesthetics on the banks, whether that is the the trails will be uh, rehabbed in a lot of areas. We'll make a lot of areas more ADA compliant. Um, you'll be seeing a lot of uh, new lighting going in throughout the, the facility or along the facilities. Uh, those will go all the way down to City Park. And then in addition to that, uh, there are a lot of other elements incorporated into the project, um, such as art features and, and those type of things, which will make the River Watch much, River Walk much more exciting. Uh, you'll see lighting going in on the bridges, uh, LED lighting that'll change in colors and, and so forth. So a lot of, lot of uh, elements all going in in addition to just the bank stabilization. The entire river project is, is uh, anticipated to take 18 months to complete. Um, so this of course being the first phase, I really think uh, this phase will take eight or nine months um, to, to get completed. We would probably start the second phase in January or February, uh, but this portion of the river will probably not be totally complete by then. The, the work along the river banks themselves uh, will be done as far as stabilization, those kind of things where we can let the water back into this section, but uh, a lot of our lighting work and artwork, those kind of things will probably still uh, be going on.